The Seasnake Micro Reel is an ultra compact video inspection system designed for main and branch lines. The unit's small size and light weight make it easy to transport and store, and its 100 foot push cable gives you the distance you need to handle many common applications. The Micro Reel can be used with either a full size Seasnake monitoring system or with the rigid Micro Explorer and kits are available to let you configure the micro reel for use with either type of monitor. The micro reel can be used in lines from one and one half to four inches and can negotiate multiple 90s in lines two inches and larger. When you need to inspect lines as small as one and one quarter inches or negotiate ultra tight turns, you can purchase the optional micro drain drum kit. The Microdrain's patent-pending 30-foot push cable has an ultra-tight minimum bend radius that can negotiate many toilets and P-traps. Swapping drums is fast and efficient. The case uses two quick-release slide latches and has a hinged clamshell design for quick drum swaps in the field. Adding the Microdrain drum kit to your micro reel gives you maximum capability with minimum size and cost. The micro reel is available with the optional Count Plus distance measuring device. The Count Plus can display date, time, distance information, and descriptive text that you can customize to suit your needs. The micro reel includes an inline transmitter, or SOND, which is located inside the camera head. When activated, the SOND transmits a signal that can be located with a rigid receiver, so you can pinpoint the camera's position and depth. The micro reel also includes ball type pipe guides. Pipe guides help center the camera and the line for a better image and can help the camera negotiate fittings and offsets. In the next few minutes, we'll show you how to set up the micro reel and connect it to your Sea Snake or Micro Explorer monitoring system. We'll review its basic setup and operation and give you some tips and techniques that will help you get the most out of your equipment. Before operating the unit, be sure to read the operator's manual. The operator's manual contains important safety information and usage instructions not covered in this video. The micro reel's modular design makes it easy to add or change components as your needs grow. The standard 30 meter push cable can be replaced with the ultra flexible micro drain push cable by simply swapping out the drum. Once the case is opened, the drum simply lifts out for replacement. The micro reel gives you a choice of two slippering modules, one for use with a sea snake monitoring system and one for use with the rigid micro explorer. The modules use a quick release bayonet mount, which makes swapping modules fast and easy. The micro reel comes equipped with either a soft handle and carrying strap, or a cradle for the micro explorer, and kits are available that let you change to the alternate handle type. When using the cradle, you can install it so that the micro explorer faces forward or backward to suit your working preference. Before connecting the micro reel to your monitor, make sure the correct slip ring module is installed. To connect to the micro explorer, position the connector housing so that the label is facing up, then slide it straight onto the connector until it's fully seated. To connect the micro reel to a sea snake monitor, position the connector so that the ridge on the strain relief is on top. Then push the connector straight onto the sea snake system connector jack and tighten the locking sleeve. Once your equipment is connected, you can power on the monitor and begin using your system. If you're not familiar with your monitor's features and controls, review its operating instructions before using your equipment. The micro reel is equipped with an inline transmitter, or SOND, which is located inside the camera head. When activated, the SOND transmits a signal that can be located with a rigid receiver so you can pinpoint the camera's position and depth. 
full size monitoring systems have a dedicated control for turning the sonde on and off. This control varies depending on your monitor, so refer to your monitor's operating instructions for details. If you're using a rigid microexplorer, you can activate the sonde by simply turning the lighting all the way down. When the sonde is operating, you may see faint noise lines on the display. These lines are normal and will disappear when you turn the sonde off. To turn the sonde off, simply turn the lights back up. For instructions on locating the sonde, refer to the operating instructions that came with your receiver. If your micro reel is equipped with the optional Count Plus, you can use it to enhance your diagnostic capabilities. The Count Plus can display two types of distance measurements, the total distance and the distance between any two points. To measure the total distance, place the camera in the access point and then zero the distance reading by pressing and holding the zero key until the display resets to zero. To measure the distance between two points, position the camera at the starting point, then press and release the zero key. This temporarily sets the count reading to zero, making it easy to measure the distance to the second point in the line. To clear this measurement and return to the total distance, simply press and release the zero key again. The Count Plus can also display the time and date, and you can cycle through the time and date display options by pressing the clock key. In addition to its basic distance and time display options, the Count Plus can also display text information, and this is covered in Sea Snake Tips and Tricks, which is included on this DVD. The micro reel can be used with or without a pipe guide, but in many cases you'll find that using a pipe guide improves your ability to see inside the pipe and makes it easier to push through the line. To install a pipe guide, make sure that the red sliding locks are in the unlocked position and that the blue latches are fully opened. Then slide the guide over the camera head and position it on the spring close to the camera head. To secure the guide, press the blue latches all the way down then slide the red locks over the latches. The micro reel's push cable is similar to the ones found on standard and mini sea snake systems, and in most cases, you can enter through the same access points and use the same camera and cable techniques that you'd use with these larger systems. These techniques are covered in sea snake tips and tricks, which is included on this DVD. The micro reel push cable isn't designed to negotiate toilets or P-traps, so if you need to enter through these access points, you'll need to purchase and install the micro drain drum kit. One item of special note is to keep your rear hand close to the cable guide when feeding the cable back into the drum. Keeping your hand close to the reel makes it easier to control the cable and helps prevent cable damage that can occur when the cable folds over on itself in kinks. In the past few minutes, we've taken a quick look at the micro reel's features, capabilities, and configuration options. We've shown you how to connect it to both SeaSnake and Micro Explorer monitors, activate the sound, and use the Count Plus. Now that you've seen the basics of operating the micro reel, stay tuned for part two, SeaSnake Tips and Tricks, which is included on this DVD. Sea Snake Tips and Tricks contains tips and techniques that will help you get the most out of your new camera system. On behalf of everyone at Rigid, thank you for buying the micro reel and thank you for watching this video.